All right. So next up for you guys, uh, we have uh, Patience. So he is a duck hunt from Hong Kong. Um, I think he just – it's either he's about to or he's about to move to California. So he, he'll soon be in the States. So I've been looking forward to see what he'll do there. Hopefully he'll connect with the scenes there, get some improvement out of that. Um, it's been a while since I've watched him. Uh, last time I remember I was spending the Zelda, from what I remember, kind of fell into the trap that like a lot of like more novice duck hunts fall into. So like always holds in on everything. Um, an issue with that. I don't remember him having as much of a clay pigeon problem, but it's like, I don't think his advantage was too good. And it was like a lot of spammy smash attacks. That's what I remember, but I could be wrong. Uh, but let's step inside to find out. No, oh, he's got no music. Um... Let's see, what music do we want to put on? Um, let's put on a... Uh, there we go. <laughs> yeah, I mean... And I don't know what your financial situation is, but cap triggers go on sale like pretty consistently. And if not, um, try to fix your Nintendo your Nintendo account so you can just upload those matches because th that is something that I can do. Because like uh, I think Wolfie was doing that, but unfortunately I, I didn't really have time to get to his stuff. So I like that you are playing at mobile right now, and it's like you're at least like have the foresight to at least hit away his projectiles. Yeah, you need to work on that. Um, like, there's a way you could have done that true. Tin Link's another one of those, like, super aerial-based fighters, so you don't really want to be going for F smashes. Not against him. I'll be very careful. So... Right here. Be very careful about air dodging in here on that because like what they can do is land and then just like F smash you. So that, that, that's a very common tactic, but luckily he didn't get you with that. Gunman makes no sense. Can's a much better choice. Um, I think he had enough time to actually back air and drift and land on stage, but you know, if he missed, you died. Okay. Okay, yeah, I like it that you're at least being patient before you throw out the can, so that's good. Yeah, you also have to keep in mind about how his stuff is going to interact with yours. So when you throw can up there, you want to kind of take the ground position because most likely he's going to hit it with something. So it will like it'll be sent away. So if you get near it, it'll more likely hit you back. That's kind of more of something for a projectile matchup. Oh, okay, so that inactivity is really bad because um, like one thing that you could have done is like when you're pinging that and you could have started dashing towards him and then like just like throw up um, and then like once that hit then you could have determined whether it was a good idea to go for a gunman or not. And remember you can toss out a gunman and still ping out ping the can at the same time too. So there's kind of no reason not to go for both of them at the very least. But you know that's kind of a hand execution thing. So you can definitely do it. Ah, yeah. Um, so remember, doing drop down jump is quicker than doing a ledge jump. A ledge jump puts you in a, like, you have to go into a handstand animation, where if you drop down jump, then you'll immediately be able to back air. So keep that in mind if you need the speed for it. Um, quick thing right here. If you see them whiff, you could just drop down up air, and then you'll basically have full stage control, and they'll be in a pretty bad spot. 
That's basically a pathetic character, though. But Duck Hunt's up air is big. Not good. Yeah, see, like, that's why I say be very careful about air dodging on stage. Because, like, he could have done... Honestly, he might have been able to get a kill off that boomerang, but he either messed up his execution or he can't do it from that space. Okay, see, that's good that you did the neutral air dodge. Because neutral air dodge, you won't land with that much lag. Yeah, see, like, when you do gunman like that, that's really good, just because, like, it's it's kind of hard for him to, like, do things in the air if you're controlling the space like that. And you see, so when you got this out, Toon Link can literally not get past this. So, like, that's a really good thing to have, like, available to you. So that's kind of, like, more extra incentive to, like, have a gunman out when you're playing these... Don't do that. When you have them at low percent, just forward throw, dash attack. And while you're doing that, you just reset your can, so then that way you can just control the space again. Because basically, you just allowed him to play neutral again, and you you just diminished your stage positioning and everything. Like, just because you have can on stage doesn't mean your opponent has to be thrown towards it. Yeah, see, like, at that point, like, since you were just, you were keeping on hit pressure him so well, like, it's not even worth going back to your can at that point, because, like, there was not much he could do. Like, he could only really just, like, flail and go for hard swings in order to try to get you off of him. So, like, just remember, like, that positional pressure that you can do. Yeah, I don't think that would have broken your shield, because, like, Tunling's up B is pretty weak. Yeah, see, like, at that point, like, you gave up all the advantage you have because you decided to go back to your can. And, like, realistically, at 103%, and when you got him at the ledge, that's when you can actually, like, try and kill him. See, that was a pretty good bait, but then you just, like, messed up your, um, your fall down there. Good thing you didn't try to punish that boomerang, because, like, the boomerang on shield's safe. So yeah, now it looks like, like, to me now, I feel like you're, like, actually watching um, where he's going. Um, but, yeah, there's a good chance that if you didn't turn around that gunman, that, that one might have killed him. So, orange coat's pretty strong. Yeah, so you want Toon Link right there. I was about to say, because, like, that, that black coat gunman would just ruin his entire projectile game. Fourth throw. Can. Yeah, so, let me explain that position to you real fast. So he had a really good position right here. So with this, this gunman takes a while. So this gunman would have covered this entire area. So you just sit back here as Duck Hunt. And the only thing that you focus on doing is covering behind the gunman. So if he rolls in, then you can get an easy up smash. Um, and then if he jumps, then you focus to go air to air with him. So you guys like, yeah, if you just stayed right there, he would have rolled right to you. And then if he decided to hold shield, then you could have ran up once the gunman shoots and then, like, got in a really good position off of that. Oh, man. I was about to say, yeah, you could have, you could have thrown an F smash there. Or even a clay pigeon. Uh, but now Clay Pigeon, I think he's at too high of a percent for Clay Pigeon to kill him. Uh, remember, um, if Can misses, ping it a couple of times so the gra- like, ping it two times so the gravity gets heavy, and it resets faster. And also, Toon Link does not have a good hitbox below him, like, he's got Dare, but that's about it. So you can just kind of, like, go up and up air him if you really need to. It's not really too scary being below, uh, Toon Link in particular. Now you just want to toss him off stage. Like, just go for an F throw at this point. And uh, up throw will actually kill pretty soon because, like, Toon Link is not heavy. You could have killed him with up air there. He was definitely within range. 
Oh, yep, your nerves are getting you now. Yeah, nerves. You could have actually kept pinging the can to, like, actually chase him down and kill him. And the other thing, too, is, like, right there, if you decided to dash up an F-tilt there, he would have died as well. Again, yeah, you're, like, your hesitation's getting you. Because, like, you had more than enough time to react to a roll. Like, something I should stress is if you're standing right here and Toon Link is at ledge, he has nothing that he can physically do to hit you immediately. Like, if he decides to go for boomerang, okay, I could just hold shield. If he decides to go for bomb, like, okay, he can chuck that at me and then, like, land with a fair, but that's not going to be safe and you can punish it. No, Joy-Cons. Okay. Okay, good. You played the War of Attrition there. Um, but yeah, I mean, that just kind of highlights just, like, you know, just being patient and understanding the positional advantage you have will actually go, like, a super, super long way and like, just improving on how well that you just execute off of certain instances. Alright, see ya. Um, wait, how do I get out of that? Um, but yeah, no, I mean, that, that's mostly what it comes down to. So just like, as your name suggests, be a little bit more patient, understand what you have going on for you. And then if you take advantage of that, that you'll just capitalize a lot more on each situation. Um, definitely later on in the game, you're playing, you're playing really well to avoid all those projectiles. So kudos to that. Um, it's just like, understand what punishes you're supposed to go for in certain situations. Um, cause like, you know, earlier on, you just want to focus on damage. So like... Um, getting like those fares and everything and leading to that but like once you get your opponent to like 120 that's when you can start planning the way that you're going to kill them it's so, like whether it be a smash attack a good back air like a setup off of like a clay pigeon a gunman or something like that or just like waiting for that roll to happen um then you'll start to like close out stocks a lot earlier too so keep that in mind um do you have any questions specifically about toon link or anything like that or are y'all good All right, well, that's going to be...